emergency is in effect. Exterior gates open. Passage clear. I'm sure of one thing. I know I am the real me. What? What is this place? How did I get here? I can't remember. I can't remember myself. My gosh, I, I don't even know who I am. Disengaging door locks. Displaying information on selected organism. What do you know? Looks like I have a name after all. Raz. Raz Carsey. Revival program has been changed due to state of emergency. Original setting for date and time of revival. Eternity. Eternity? They never meant to let me out. If it wasn't for this state of emergency, I'd have been in the deep freeze forever. Man, what a horrible way to die. 
What is that? A disease? I hope it's not contagious. State of emergency. Proceed State of complete disaster from the like it. Disruption detected. Mm -hmm. Main power station. Activate emergency power bypass. Repeat. Disruption detected in main. No wonder the station. elevators are out of service. Activate emergency power bypass. I've got to get out of here before I'm in the same shape he is. No. It's too late. I'm infected. <laughs> this can't be happening. How did I catch it? Oh, for God's sake, what is it? What have I done to deserve this? If only I could remember who I am, maybe it would help me understand. What now? The power's up. It should be running. Move, darn you! Don't leave us trapped like this! People. Come on, people. You'll pull through, I know you can. Shake it off, Peepo. Self-diagnose, you can make it. Don't leave me, Peepo. Peepo! Thank goodness I found you. What? No! Stay away! Oh! I thought you were... that... thing. I can't tell you how relieved I am. I'm so glad to find another person. My name is Raz Carsey. Millie Azray. Nice to meet you. The military's playing us for fools. We've got to shut down the project. Don't be absurd. This was supposed to be about enhancing longevity, improving immunological defenses, but they've corrupted it. You're naive if you thought we could limit how our findings are applied. Sure, we may not lie. Now who's being naive? Any good that might have come of this will never see the light of day. We're only helping them create their synthetic soldiers, mindless killers. It's a trade-off. Think of the medical advantages. Think of the death. Don't be so overly dramatic. All we're doing is enhancing some natural genetic selections. It's as natural as cross-selecting these trees for strength and beauty. Beauty? How dare you talk of beauty? What we're doing is monstrous and deadly. If anything should happen to this facility... Nothing's going to happen. If the virus should escape into the environment, there's no telling what could happen. It could destroy all humanity. Zeus. Inquiry. Estimate time until the reactor core goes critical. Approximately 67 minutes until total destruction. That doesn't leave much time to get her out of there. Rescue is problematic. My remote sensors show extensive damage to the facility. We've got to save her before his transformation is complete. When he changes, he'll turn on her just like the others. This subject exhibits increased resiliency. I know. He's the first subject to have a gradual transformation instead of changing instantaneously. True. It is probable that his slow rate of metamorphosis will allow him to survive the transformation. Then he could prove to be our first success. A fully integrated biogenic unit. Your research is on the verge of realization. How ironic that he must be destroyed anyway. Further study of this subject is warranted. 
I recommend we retain him. No, no, we must destroy him. Besides, we don't have the facilities anymore to contain him safely. Separating the subject from Dr. Azrae may complicate her rescue. I don't want any excuses. I'm only interested in saving her and killing him. Is that clear? Understood. Regarding the counterfeit project... Counterfeit project? Letter of protest. It is my deep concern that the National Defense Committee is asserting intolerable pressure on the Lystra Laboratory to redirect our research away from peaceful aims by introducing the ARNA virus into the systems of our cloned subjects. Although evidence suggests the subjects will develop enhanced sensory skills, memory deletion will render the subjects virtual slaves. The only logical application would be to create mindlessly obedient soldiers. Memory deletion? I must protest the involvement of the Defense Committee with the Lystra Laboratories on this project. Our goals have always been peaceful, promoting proactive natural genetic advances to help fight disease, enhance stamina and strength, and accelerating the natural development of the human species. Allowing the military to hijack our work would be short-sighted and dangerous. It must not happen. Accordingly, I am demanding an immediate suspension of the counterfeit project. Signed, Millie Azray, Project Associate Director. Millie wrote this. She's been in on it the whole time. Zeus, you fool! Why didn't you destroy Millie's letter? I am a computer. I cannot be a fool. Oh yeah? It was certainly foolish to let him see that. It is foolish to be concerned over things you cannot change. This information is no use to him. No use? You're not accounting for human emotions. There's no telling what he may do if he finds out the truth about her. He's unstable. What do you suppose he might do when he realizes she helped make him the way he is? An interesting query. It's obvious Millie is one of those who made Raz. If he finds that out... He may attempt to terminate her. A card key. A lot of good it is without its lock. Maybe... Oh. <gasps> Raz! Fight it, Raz! Millie! I can't... I can't go on. I'm losing it, Millie. Raz! Run, Millie! Get away from me! Success. The subject has survived the transformation. A fully integrated biogenic unit. Success? Disaster! He almost killed Millie! Analysis suggests perfect physical transformation. Though mental functions would seem to require fine-tuning. Fine-tuning? He's completely out of his mind! Precisely. Just what the military ordered. We must preserve this subject for refinement. I say there is no need. There is no need! I'm not interested in him. I want him dead. It's Millie that I... that we've got to save. Attention all personnel. Evacuate immediately. Repeat. An earthquake measuring magnitude 8.9 has... Local epicenter... Aftershocks... All personnel. Emergency procedures now in effect. Cryogenic storage units have been compromised. Infected subjects are no longer secured. Evacuate your main computer room on upper level immediately. So that's what got us into this mess. An earthquake. And it released those beasts. We can't just abandon everything. All of our work, our experiments, I refuse to let it all be lost. Don't worry. Zeus has already evacuated everything essential. But the center must be destroyed to prevent the virus from being released into the environment. But... but... our subjects! The subjects? Don't make me laugh. I know what you're interested in, that clone. Forget it. She's expendable. 
How dare you? She's everything I've worked for. I won't sacrifice her. For goodness sake, it's not her. It's it. And it isn't worth risking our lives for. You think of her as just another entry in your logbook. But she's real. Flesh and blood. As real to me as she ever was. Face it. She's not your Millie. She's just a clone. This conversation is pointless. The self-destruct mechanism is set for 24 hours, and we... I didn't authorize that! You better hope I have time to save her, or you'll pay! Take it easy. What's done is done. Never! I won't lose her! Whatever it takes! My Millie! My Millie? Huh? Millie, can you hear me? Who is that? Finally, they can hear me. Answer me! Who's there? Millie, listen to me carefully. There's no time to explain. The center is going to self-destruct. I know. You know? Then hurry. There isn't much time. I can't leave him. Have you lost your mind? Leave him. Don't be afraid. He's safe. Safe? I'm telling you, he won't hurt anyone. Do you think I care about that? I want him dead. Then I'll die with him. No, leave him. You must. You're my... That wasn't me. That was a different Millie. All I have in common with her is a DNA strand and memories. What are you saying? Millie, you are my... It's that man. He's twisting your mind. Your wife is dead. I love this man. You love me. I made sure of it by saving... <laughs> Forget about him, Raz. We've got to go. Mm. An interesting turn of events. Shut up! You were correct. These human emotions have no standardization. I've got one more chance to bring her back to me. By force? If it comes to that... That is predictable. In fact, it is almost I love certain. her too much to lose her. However, her feelings... Shut up! I won't listen to any more of your electro-psychobabble! Stay away from her. Astonishing, really, that you've survived this long. You've left me no choice but to terminate you myself. What do you want with Millie? Simple. To pick up where we left off. As husband and wife. That Millie is dead. You've no right to this woman. Right? How dare you question my rights? She's a perfect duplicate. I've seen to that. She's my Millie in every way. Except that she doesn't love you. And you think she loves you? You have no idea how preposterous that is. I've devoted every waking minute, every ounce of my being to restoring her. If you think I'm going to lose her now to you, you're mad. Nothing you can do can change that now. No. I have her back at last. Everything will be the way it was between us. Who the hell do you think you are? <laughs> Don't you know by now? I am Raz Carsey. No! Zeus, light please. You're nothing but a clone. Of me. Me? A clone? It's not true. You're nothing but a lab experiment, cultured from a single hair from my head. You're nothing. You're lying. You know it's the truth. You don't have a memory, do you? That's because I didn't give you one. What does a lab rat like you need with a memory? You're just one in a long line of experiments, and the experiment is over. Ten minutes to self-destruct. Fine. Millie and I will be on our way, just as soon as I deal with this one last detail. Killing the last clone. I'd rather be dead than go through life with someone as evil as you. It's me you love. You're my Millie! You are as meaningless to me as a lump of mold in a petri dish. I won't let you hurt him. 
I love him. Your Millie is dead. Think of the gift I've given you. Your life back. Farewell. We can pick up where we left off. It's your fault. If you didn't exist, she'd accept me again. She could never accept you. You're a cold-blooded murderer. Murderer? Those others, they wanted to abandon my Millie. To leave her to die here. It wasn't murder. It was self-preservation. Time's up, Chloe. Don't! Aftershock! No! It's not fair! No! 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 I... He was... I was him! I... I was so close! Oh. Oh.